Hello, hello, this is Mr. Chabry. We're here. We are here. Doing some good work. Before I start, there's some stuff that I need to do to make sure. Okay, things are looking good. Okay. But anyway. Why is this taking... Okay. I had to check something. Sorry, guys. Um, I'm going to go up around here. You can cut to skip. But we're going to go down here to battle this guy. Because what's the point of not battling this guy? We could get the experience. We can steal his cash. We just got done stealing from a rich man. A TM swagger. But anyway, this guy's got a Kadabra. Which is actually a pretty decent Pokemon. A lot of times you're not seeing the, these really good Pokemon out here. And that will give us some speed EVs, I do believe. Yeah, because it's fast. Uh, it could be special attack EVs too. I don't know. It's one or the other. The omelet. Omelet. So what are you doing on here, omelet? I'm going to probably switch omelet out once I find something to replace omelet with. I don't know what to do with what go, to go with yet. Anyway, let's go up here. Yes, of course, because we are going through muck and mud. And there's a lot of officers that I might come back to battle uh, on my own, I guess. I don't know. There's a lot of time-sensitive trainers. And I usually do recording in the morning anyway, so... All right, let's see here. What can we do? Um, we're just going to throw a brine. Why would we not throw a brine at this guy? I I do want to give one of my Pokemon some sort of electric move. Hmm, that's what I want to do. I was ho actually actually I was hoping a Lark would learn an electric move, but a Lark does not. Uh, another brine. Boom. Knockout. Simple and easy. Another Geo. This guy's got what? Three Geo dudes? Why? Boom. Simple and easy. Boom. Nice. All right. And the problem with this route is it, it's kind of a slog. Uh, eventually, we're going to get to where we're going to, you know, get some problems with some muck. But until then, we're fine. Go. What are you? How are you walking on that? I can't even walk on that. What are you doing down there? Oh, you're over here now. You're like all over the place, dude. Um, I would battle these guys, but they more than likely have a team of magic carps. I don't feel like battling a team of magic carps. Um, they actually might not, but you know, we're just going to get to the next route. That's that's a way back, which I don't need to go back. If you need to go back and you want to skip a lot of the grass, you can do that. Shards wanted. Uh, we can eventually get more shards and go in here. Um, I don't think I've got enough, but I don't think it even tells you what shard, what TMs you'll get. Uh, anyway, there's this person with a parasol here or an umbrella. Umbrella. Parasol lady. Yeah. Goldeen, of course. Uh, we don't have... We don't have an electric type, which would be really cool to get leveled up. Um, that's the kind of a problem with Sinnoh, is that they're kind of stingy with certain types. Fire types? Hardly anything. Electric types? There's hardly any of those either. Um, sing a song. Come on, Earhart. Let's 
go ahead and aerial ace. I think an aerial ace should do fine. Boom. Oh, we'll just stay in. Weasel. Um, at least she doesn't have a team of six Goldines. Or six magic cards. Wow, why, why a game programmers. Why would you give a trainer a bunch of magic harps? Why? I'll battle them off screen if I have to. The completionist in me might. But the I don't want to battle them. Part of me is saying just don't battle them. Anyway. We'll go up around. Um There are some items up there. Oh, and this is the problem with this route because you will fall in the muck. Toxic's actually a good move. Toxic is a good move. I'll try to battle this lady. Oh, she doesn't even battle. Let's actually uh, switch. Who do I want? I want... I so badly want Alaric to not fall behind, but it's raining, guys. What, what's it going to do? I can use flamethrower in the rain. I try to teach it Thunderbolt. It won't learn Thunderbolt. Alright, here comes Lupcio. I'm going to psychic this thing into oblivion, ob obviously. Get that Intimidate. We're going to give this thing a piece of its own medicine. I don't care about the Intimidate. Who do you think I am? Scared of you? <laughs> no, don't be silly. Alright, one shot, knockout. Boom, and Alaric leveled up anyway. No thanks to the route that I'm currently in. And a psychic should do the job. Yeah. Boom. You've got some energy to burn. I do. Alright, now we can actually go down here and get that one item. On the top side. Oh, get that over there. I see that. Oh, I gotta remember to go and grab that. You know what? You know what? Alright, come on, buddy. You're falling behind, and I don't want you to. Can't have you fall behind. Special attack X. X special attack. And there's some stuff over here that we're gonna go ahead and take care of. A bottle of zinc, which is nice. Here's a Paracel Lady once again. There's a few more trainers on this route. She might have water tie back. I don't, you know. Um, I wonder if Alaric can learn Grass Knot. I'll just mock punch. Ooh, yeah, two hit KO. Coming in. Yeah, hit me with Zen Headbutt. I don't care. Yeah, look at that. Look how little that did. Actually. Alright, hold the umbrella. Let's go ahead. I'm just going to see if Grass Knot is teachable. Shockwave is not. Grass Knot? No. I need, you need some sort of coverage option. Coverage option? Tracked. You learn Brick Break? That's garbage. Swagger? A lot of garbage moves. 
You can learn all the garbage stuff, at least. Alright, this is worth an evaluation. Scientist Sean, he's got two Pokemon. Abra, okay. I think Flamethrower still should do work for us. Boom, nice. Nice. Oh, we'll just stay in. Cadavers shouldn't be that bad. Alright, we'll just go for the same thing here. Boom, nice. Alright, and we're almost done with this route. There's just a few more Pokemon. A few more trainers, that is. Not Pokemon. Of course they do have Pokemon. Um, I do want to go down here. I do want to go up here to grab this Revive, which is nice. Um, and this is actually Pastoria City right here. Which I want to go ahead and heal up. Yeah, look at him. Wow, he can actually keep up. I do feel like some items here. Breathe out a bit of fire. Where is... There's the gym. There's the Pokemon Center. I'm going to go ahead and heal up. Hmm. Let's go ahead and heal up. And you know what? Some of those trainers that we kind of skipped, we could go back and face them. How about that? I do like that idea. I do like that idea. Completionist. Actually. Alright, so next up we're going to have to face the gym. We could check out the... Uh, There's nothing up there for us. Let me go ahead and bag. Where's my repel? I got four more. Alright, we're gonna go. Battle was fishermen. Why not? Um, eventually, I, I don't think we went through the haunted tower. I think that's something we should do. All right, we'll go ahead and battle these people. Mark, um, yeah, we'll go ahead. Go ahead and uh, lark. Let's get some. Let's get some experience with a lark against these water types. Who knows? Something might be easy to knock out. Goldeen, hmm, not easy to knock out, but we can switch into something good. We'll go into Catherine for the Giga Drain. <clears throat> Pretty much best case scenario here. Yeah, pretty easy. Horn attack. That's nothing. That's nothing. Watch this. Watch all that health. Bring that health back. That health that you knocked out with your horn. I just took it back. What can you do about that, Goldine? What can you do about that? Oh, Barb Roach. Okay. This is water ground. The water ground fish. In the sea of water ground types, this is the one that's terrible. This is really the only... Um, Whiskash is the only one that's terrible. You know, you've got Quagsire, who's decent. you got Gastrodon, who's good. Swampert, who is good. Barbroach, uh, Whiskash are the only water ground that is terrible. There's not that many trainers that we skip. There's only three. Oh, this is the Magikarp dude, aren't you? 
Oh, Barbroach. Okay. Barbroach. Not much of a problem. Now, if this thing could you learn Grass Knight, that would be great. Uh, that would be so great. Um, but it can't. I think as a Magmortar, though, it should be able to learn Energy Ball. And I think it does learn Thunderbolt, too. Which is actually amazing. We're confused. Don't worry, that's my natural state. Oh, yeah, my natural state. Um, finish off Barboach. We'll probably just let Catherine knock all these out. There are probably four bar brooches. Yeah, it's pretty simple. You know, unfortunate thing is we're confused right now, but... <clears throat> yeah, okay, we're not. Yeah, one Giga Drain should do the job for each bar brooch. There's no way that they're looking at Giga Drain. Their heart's level 34. Another bar brooch. Great. Easy peasy. And it's gone. It is gone. Oh, Shellos! A change up! Now, if you had Shellos on your team, that is actually a really good water ground type. It is an amazing water ground type. Um, it's not very fast, though. If you like fast Pokemon on your team, you're probably not wanting to shell out a position for Shellos. But, it is a good Pokemon. Let's think. There's one more trainer. Ooh. Airheart's evolving. Great. Beautiful. Beautiful. Staraptor. Who I'm going to a box eventually when I decide what Pokemon's going to take its place. But for right now, look at this. This is actually a really cool design. That is a cool design. Predator Pokemon. Close combat is an amazing move. Get rid of Growl. You still running Growl? You don't need to try to look cute anymore. You can just smack things down with a vengeance. Yeah, and more trainer. Hopefully this guy doesn't have a bunch of barboaches. He's only got one Pokemon. Gyarados, who oh, is kind of a problem, no matter how you try to spin it. Um, intimidate. I'll just go ahead and switch, though. Catherine does the job very well. Catherine does this job very well, yeah. And I want that experience, too. Twister, that's a dragon-type move. But it's weak. It, it, you would think it's like it would be a stronger dragon type move. A twister. It's like a like a tornado. Those are pretty destructive. But no, the move that's actually named after him is one of the weakest moves. Like, I think they should bump up the power of Twister. That's what I think they should do because it, it is a really weak move, very weak. And it, it's a move that a lot of Pokemon don't get till later on anyway. So. Why is it so weak? Alright, that thing goes down. Napoleon levels up. Jean of Gaunt levels up. We'll have to spam B. Alright, and let's spam B. Spam B. Yeah, thank you for stop evolving. But anyway, now that we've been to Pastoria, look at that. We can just fly there. Oh, was that our 
Earhart? Oh, Earhart, come back! Actually, it's a wild Earhart. It's a wild uh, Staravia. Or Staraptor. What am I saying? But anyway, we're going to end this here. We did a lot in this episode. And we have made it to Pastoria City, where we will check out the marsh. Don't don't worry, I haven't forgot that we'll check out the Haunted Tower and the Haunted Mansion. We'll do that together. Um, and then we'll battle Crasher Wake. If you like this, thumbs up, subscribe. I'll see you in the next Pokemon video.